I already told you, you're not getting into heaven. Stealing from a baby is never acceptable, even if it is just stockies. Come on, dog. It was one time. I was hungry and desperate for food. I'm sorry, but your application is declined. What do you mean I'm declined? Next. Um, hello, hi. I just want to start off by saying that this whole operation is extremely unorganized. I was waiting in the lobby for hours. I'm sorry you feel that way, ma'am. We try to process people as fast as we can. <laughs> well, let's not waste any more time, shall we? <laughs> I have some family members I want to see. First, we need to see what kind of person you were. What is your name? Karen Taylor, named after my mother, of course. Should have known. She does look like a Karen. Um, excuse me? Oh, nothing. Let's see what we got here. Karen, Karen, ooh, Karen Taylor. Here you are. Can we please speed it up? We all know I'm a good person. I don't see the point of all of this. Ma'am, before coming through the gates of heaven, it's critical we evaluate everyone's past sins. And by the look of it, you've committed several pages worth of sins. Oh no, that, that can't be me. I went to church every Sunday. I always treated everyone with respect. Mm, actually, this says otherwise. In addition to all the unpaid parking tickets, use of expired coupons, and money laundering, you've been pretty sinful. It must be a different Karen. It's a common name. Mm, no, it's definitely you. In 2012, it states that you called the police on someone for having a barbecue at the park. Do you mind explaining that? Oh, yeah, 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 that, that is me. Okay, okay, how could I forget? Yeah, I just hate when the smoke is all in my face when I'm on my morning walk with my little shih tzu. You know, people really think they own the park and honestly, it's just really unacceptable to me. The park is public and barbecues are allowed. I don't see the issue. Well, I have a breathing condition and the smoke affects my lungs severely. And you know, I do ask them to shut it down very nicely, I might add. And they never listen to me. If barbecue smoke affected you, then why did you go to the park? I had every right to be at that park. And they also have that right. <laughs> no, they don't. They also use poison when they cook. Do you mean seasonings? Yeah, whatever it's called. But more of the story is that I would still call the police on them if I was still alive. To get in here, you need to love thy neighbor. So I'm not too sure about that. But let's move on. We have many more sins to go through. Ooh, that's not a good one. This states that you destroyed an elotero cart? Well, it was actually four in a three month span, but who's counting? Anyway, there's some of the most selfish people out there. I don't understand. They literally just sell corn. Yeah, but um, they do it without a permit. <laughs> yeah, 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 crazy, right? And they walk around all over the street like they own the place. In my country, we have laws that need to be followed and they're not following them. How did you know they didn't have a permit? Did you ask them? No, 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 no. We both know they don't have permits. How can we know their food is safe to eat? And I know for a fact their corn is FDA approved. Well, actually, this states that they did have one. Well, that's because- You have the audacity to drive to the other side of town just to harass people. For your information, I drive to that side of town for my Pilates class and I was not harassing them. If anything, they were harassing me with all their honking and yelling. Anyway, I was doing a service for my community. No, what you are doing is called harassment and I would label that as wrath, which is one of the deadly sins. I think you're being extremely judgmental right now. It's not nice, is it? Moving on. Oh, wow. Now that is a sin. What nonsense is it this time? You made a scene and threatened a worker at a store. Threatened? I would never do something like that. Is this you? You're the stupidest worker I have ever dealt with. I want to see. That is a violation. I never gave my consent to be recorded. Tell me who sent you that because I'm gonna get my lawyer involved. And here you are demonstrating pride, which is another deadly sin. I can say with confidence that things are not 
looking good for you. Okay, okay, I've had enough of this nonsense. Let me speak to your manager. The big man's occupied right now, so that makes me the manager. This is simply unacceptable. I will not be taking this slander on me and my character. I will be suing you and everyone in this establishment. I know some powerful people and they will definitely be hearing about this. Oh, Karen, your methods don't work here and I think I've seen everything I've needed. Can you please just let me go? I'm feeling very uncomfortable and my life feels very threatened at the moment. Settle down, hun. That's it. You've given me no choice. I'm calling the police. You're done. You have been rejected from entering heaven. You can try those Karen tactics in the next place. What do you mean the next place? Ah, would you look at that? Just in time for lunch. What is up guys? Hope you enjoyed that video. If you liked it, make sure you give it a like because it helps us a lot. And let us know in the comments down below if you want to see more Karen videos. Or just comment down below something because we read every single one of your guys' comments. And uh, with all that being said, click right here to check out our last video which was Squid Games. And it is dope, so definitely check it out. And click right here if you aren't subscribed yet. And with all that being said, we'll see you guys next time. Hey, if you guys are still watching right now, comment down below. Karen.